There is a good reason why the Australort chicken breed is the honorary national bird of Australia. In spite of being a relatively new breed, these chickens are one of the best you can choose for your homestead. In this video, we are going to show you why these birds may be ideal for you, but also clue you into some of the lesser known drawbacks that you may need to consider. If you're interested in our infographic on these chickens, then be sure to stick around until the end of the video for your own downloadable copy. Let's get started with a bit of history. The name Australorp is a contraction of Australian Black Orpington. In Australia during the early 1900s, the Australorp was developed through crossings between Orpingtons and Rhode Island Reds, and to a lesser extent other breeds like White Leghorns. The result was a robust chicken with fantastic egg-laying abilities. The current egg-laying record for the breed is 364 eggs laid in 365 days. Given this, it is no surprise that the Australorp is still a favorite amongst hobbyists and free-range growers alike. The Australorp is easily identifiable due to its black feathers, which have an emerald tint and gleam in the sun. There are other varieties that have white and blue feathers too, although the latter is quite rare. These are large chickens and can weigh between 3 and 4.5 kilograms, depending on the sex and age of the bird. Hens generally do not exceed 3.5 kilograms while the roosters weigh about 1 kilogram heavier. There are also miniature bantam varieties, where the roosters seldom exceed 1 kilogram in weight and the hens barely reach 800 grams. Given this, you should always confirm whether or not the variety you are purchasing is indeed a large or bantam australorp, as each will be suited to different situations. These birds stand upright and proud. They have red wattles and combs with dark beaks and eyes. It has already been made clear that these prolific layers are suited for egg production. You can expect to receive around 250 eggs per year from a single chicken in a backyard operation, but a commercial setup can expect around 300 eggs per hen per year with additional inputs. It must also be mentioned that they do not require supplemental lighting in order to lay such high quantities and are therefore perfect for small-scale growers and novice chicken rearers. The eggs are medium size and light brown in color. Due to their large bodies, Australorp chickens can also be used for meat production, making them a great dual-purpose breed. A great option for beginners, the Australorps do not require any specialized intervention for them to remain healthy and productive. While they can tolerate confinement, they prefer to roam free. These chickens benefit from exercise, and because of their large bodies, require it to maintain healthy weights. They are therefore perfect for free-range conditions. As with any chicken breed, parasites such as mites and worms can be controlled through regular treatment. Australorp chickens can survive most environments, from the scorching hot to the bitingly cold. Just make sure they have enough shade, water, feed and shelter and they will take care of themselves. In especially cold areas, you may need to cover the coxcombs with petroleum jelly to keep the frostbite at bay. When it comes to feeding, Australorps are not fussy. Just be sure to supplement their feed with a protein source when they molt. Each hen should be provided with their own laying box. These should be around 30 cm by 30 cm large. The Australorp is an extremely tame breed. The hens even like to be picked up and held, making them a perfect pet. This characteristic also makes these chickens great for households with kids and other pets. Due to their peaceful nature, they also accept other chicken breeds. Unfortunately, this does make them vulnerable to bullying from more dominant chickens. While the Australorp hens are docile and on the whole rather quiet, the roosters are vocal and will make themselves known wherever they might be. So, if you live in the city or have neighbors in close proximity, you may wish to choose another breed. Australorp hens are not very broody, so if you are looking to hatch your own chicks you may again wish to choose another chicken. With this being said, they do however make attentive mothers when the chicks hatch. These chickens have a lifespan of around 8 years. So, take this into account before you buy them. If you want to keep them as pets, you will need to be committed to 8 years of caring for your chickens. And that brings us to the end of this video on the Australorp chickens, we hope you learned something new. Let us know in the comments what breed you would like to hear about next. Remember to find the link to your own copy of our infographic in the description. Thanks for watching and see you next time.